there. This is your reading for Thursday, the 23rd of October, 2014. Thank you for joining me today in this tarot and numerology forecast for the day. Let's have a look at what's coming up. Okay, that card looks dark straight away. Let's see what's going on. The first card is the Three of Swords in Reverse. And we've got Saturn there at the top. That's really good news. It means that um, the limitations are being left behind and broken away. The Three of Swords, when it's the right way up, means betrayal and loss and heartbreak. Because it's in reverse, it means you feel great. Okay? Same thing here. Ten of Swords in reverse. Ruin. Um, being at rock bottom, feeling betrayed, feeling like things can't get any worse. It's in reverse. So what that means is that things are really looking up. So it could be that you've really been through the mill here recently. Um, that could be financially or in terms of your relationships. But really, because it's swords, I get that it's via your thinking. So it could be that you felt really down in the dumps or you lost your confidence or you thought, I can't do this because I don't have the money, something like that. A thought that had kept you down, and this is any kind of limiting belief, um, you know, lack of self-belief or um, thinking there's something wrong with you, anything like that comes to an end during this day and you're really freed up as a result. This reading with these cards looked really ominous at first, but it's really positive actually, that's great. And then finally, the Knight of Discs. The Knight of Discs is someone who's really, you can see that heavy suit of armor there, the big disc, the solidity, the strength. You've become stronger as a result of this. And you are really able to engage with your life on a day-to-day -day basis and move forward and get through these situations that may have been tough for you in the past. So this is really um, a very powerful, strong day when you really become um, a, you know, like a knight, a soldier of your own feelings, of your own emotions. And you've overcome those difficulties and now you're able to move forward, even though it can be difficult. And you can move forward into that sunlight of the spirit and you can be happy again. So you're on the path to happiness. 3 and 10 is 13 and 1 is 14. 1 and 4 is 5. So 5 is freedom. You are on your way to emotional freedom. Really tune into that. Please remember to subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you'd like a private reading with me, please get in touch via my website, which is gregoryscott.com or tweet me. It's gregoryscott444.